In the world where unemployment and job security after school is not guaranteed, the Resilient Africa Network, RAN, has continuously engaged university students in entrepreneurial principles, skills and innovations to change their mindset so that they can become job creators. The fourth innovation fireplace attracted motivational speakers, policymakers and students. Here the students were advised to always register their ideas with Uganda Registration Service Bureau. The young people are out there, there is no need for being discouraged. Focus as to, because the future lies with you. We know our problems. We must make Uganda a better place, a more comfortable place, using our technology around us. The students were involved in innovation fireplace sessions that provided them with opportunity to interface with notable entrepreneurs, managers of top brands, among others, to update students on the latest projects that, that satisfy community needs. Up with ideas and have made products to the final stage, but we find it hard to get market for them. And the registration of, of copyrights, patents, and then the business, is it free of charge? It's supposed to be is it after teaching some uh, funders or when they just started to develop? The students were advised to save and start small on their ideas. To start your business small and not try to do everything at once. And this is the main takeaway that at least the youth were given today. And we also gave them a lot of mentorship opportunities that they can come for. Uh, they are through the government of Uganda, they are through RAN and a number of other organizations. Resilient Africa Network has supported over 300 and that strengthens the resilience of vulnerable communities using innovative evidence-based approaches developed in collaboration with uni university students and the community. Zahara Bigaba, UBC.